नमस्ते एंड वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल क्यूबिड एजुकेशनल सर्विसेज वी आर सॉल्विंग द फिजिक्स एम सी क्यूज फ्रॉम एस एर एप्टीट्यूड टेस्ट टू थाउजेंड एंड नाइनटीन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी सिक्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी कंप्लीटेड द फर्स्ट टेन एम सी क्यूज दिस इज अवर इलेवेंथ एम सी क्यू एंड इलेवेंथ वीडियो इन अवर सीरीज द अलाउड एनर्जी लेवल्स ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन हाइड्रोजन आइटम आर गिवन बाई ई एन इक्वल टू निगेटिव Uh, upon n squared electron volt uh, for electronic transition in hydrogen atom what is the maximum frequency of the emitted photon we are given the values of the planck's constant and the charge on electron now two things are necessary to solve this problem first thing is the connection between the energy of the photon and the frequency because after all we want to find the frequency right so this is the relation e is equal to h nu okay this is the relation but here uh, e has to be in joules e has to be in joules and the second one is already given in the problem en is negative 13.6 upon n squared electron volt now what is the maximum energy difference we can say maximum energy difference okay e max is actually 13.6 ev itself when electron jumps from n equal to infinity to ground state that is n equal to 1 correct well that's the maximum difference that you can have energy difference but there is a problem this is an electron volt so i have to first convert it to um, joules right therefore what is the frequency it is e by h in this e let us write 13.6 but this is not acceptable because it is in a different unit so let us convert this to joule by multiplying it by 1.6 into 10 raised to negative 19 okay that many joules will be corresponding to 13.6 electron volt upon h given in the problem already 6.62 6.62 into 10 to the power negative 30 now uh well of course we are going to do this on calculator but uh, let us try to estimate this okay let us try to estimate this observe that uh 13.6 is approximately twice 6.62 okay it is approx because 65 into 2 is 130 right okay and then uh, 2 into 1.6 that will be 3.2 uh forget about the powers of 10 now because all of them have the same So three point two, the option that is closest to three point two is uh, option C, and we don't have any option which is say let like two point nine or something or two point eight. We have two point one. Okay, so it has to be option C, and it is actually the case. So let us now verify this on our calculator. Okay, calculator is here. Thirteen point six. Thirteen point six. Into one point six, into ten raised to negative nineteen plus thirty four from the denominator, six point six two. That is three point two eight seven into ten raised to fifteen. Giga means ten raised to nine, so three point three into ten raised to six gigahertz. Right, fifteen minus six is nine. So correct option is C. Fifty six option C. in our next video we will be solving question number 57